Congratulations, man. Thank you, man. Thank you, man. It's a pleasure to be here. I'm sure it is. It's like a, a yearly reservation for you at this table. I guess we'll hold it for you next year in New Orleans as well, man. It's easier said than done, man. It's always, uh, it's always a journey. Um, you know, we're talking about it year in and year out. We know we had a young team coming in, and uh, we had some experience with last year with these guys. And, you know, the, the accountability that we held each other to this year, man, um, we kind of prevailed through um, adversity. Isaiah Pacheco, it's good to see you. Congratulations. Represent, man. You don't got too many Puerto Ricans doing this thing. And, hey, Hola, culture, you always got to represent your culture. Know where you came from. <laughs> I love it. Now, I got a confession to make, fellas, and I'm not saying it because Usher did halftime. Uh, <laughs> I did open at night, okay? Got a chance to talk to uh, uh, Chris right here, and he said, Mike Rob, in Spags we trust. We will not leave this game without winning it, okay? We gave you so much confidence in this defense and in the defensive play caller in Spags. Um, just the journey we've had to take, the adversity we had to face. I think we faced the best team in the league in Baltimore Ravens, hands down. And the journey we had to take, whether it's um, being one of the most pro prolific offenses in the game in um, our first game, Miami Dolphins, and then going to a Buffalo team who was steamrolling people, and um, defeating them at home, and also going to Baltimore Ravens, which is a tough environment. MVP, Lamar Jackson, and that defense, man. And we was able to overcome them obstacles. We wasn't being defeated here. Were you guys nervous? Obviously, the defense did their thing in the first half. Offense wasn't scoring points. Did you just say, look, we just got to keep doing our thing, and Pat and Andy in this offense, they're going to get right and score some points? <laughs> you him. You know that, right? You are him, baby. You are him. I appreciate it, McCall, man. Um, yeah, we, 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 um, we know as a defense that we continue to give um, the offense the ball. Um, they'll eventually score and start to put up points. Um, Tight game first half, man. A tight game first half, and we knew it was going to be a battle coming in. Um, they got a tough team, uh, resilient, a lot of good guys on their team, and um, we knew it was going to be a four-quarter battle, even in overtime. Hey, listen, they um, they uh, had to drive. Your team under Patrick Mahomes had to drive in the fourth quarter to tie the game, force overtime, and then had to drive to put some points on the board, whether it was a field goal and continue the game or get one. Do you understand what's going through the mindset of the Niners when they're looking at Patrick Mahomes and they have to stop him? Yeah, I know they was nervous, man. <laughs> I know they was nervous because it was like nothing they can do. Um, shout out to Nick Bosa, man. Had a heck of a game. Uh, can't discredit his uh, body of work, what he did tonight, but um, it just wasn't enough this time. Now, you guys blitz on, it seemed like where well, the numbers say you guys blitzed on 50, 52, 53% of the dropbacks. What was it about? Brock Purdy in this 49ers offense that made you guys feel like you had to heat him up a little bit and kind of confuse him a little bit? Well, um, we talked over the week that um, if you just let him sit back there, he can pick you apart. They have a lot of weapons back there. And um, he's six foot, so we wanted to get somebody in his face at all times. So 50% um, of the call, I think it was like 55. <laughs> you know what time it is. We were like 55. Yeah, we were just going to pressure at him. And, you know, we knew that going in. We had um, – what seven seven to ten days to prepare anytime you give us that type of preparation we able to dial some things up look at who's smiling the guy that just gave us the walk-off winner absolutely now, let's be honest it's early october you're in new jersey playing for don't the jets me, don't mind me. <laughs> did you ever think you would be standing right here right now man that, that's probably i probably didn't um but when i knew i was going to leave i was just praying i came back to kc but guys like this man and, and Guys that I've been with my whole career. And uh, when I got back, man, I knew it was a chance that we, we could do this thing. So when that play call, call came in the huddle, the game went in play call. Did you light up, bro? I mean, I mean, did you smile? Did you did you like, come on, man, this is about to be that moment? Man, Tom and Jerry Wright. Y'all, y'all marking down. It's Tom and Jerry Wright. Um, it's a play we've been working for a long time now, man. And um, and the, the safety just, I mean, the corner just fell off on trap. I'm like, I gotta be open. You know, hey. I caught the ball and, and uh, I, I blacked out, man. I, I forgot that we, we actually won the game for a second. <laughs> Nicole and Chris, congratulations on those rings. Oh, oh, you got a buddy uh -oh, that's uh -oh. uh, attacking the set here. Patrick hey, Mahomes. Can I tell a quick funny story? Please. <laughs> I threw a touchdown to this dude at the end of the game. And he looked at me, I said, and he had no idea. I said, dude, we just won the Super Bowl. And then he, he, he said he blacked out. He had no idea. I was like, bro, because he, he didn't even celebrate at the beginning. I'm like, what are we doing? <laughs> well, I see you were talking about, okay, yeah, it's time to celebrate now. So, hey. Did, you seriously did not know the game? I, I blacked out. 
I literally backed out. I swear to God, I blacked out. Okay. But right. I'm, I'm glad this man was running towards me, though. <laughs> it get me back to life. What? What? Look. I got you. I don't know. I'm like, oh. That's crazy. Well, hey, so, once again, what's the name of this play? Um, Tom and Jerry. Uh, yeah, Tom and Jerry is the name of the play. We can guess who's who. Um, but uh, <laughs> but uh, the, same, the same motion, though. The same motion as we scored Corn Dog, and we scored a couple plays last year. So, uh, we saved it for the right moment. Very good. Hey, Chris, me, Cole, congratulations. Go party up with your troops. Absolutely. Hey, no, no, Patrick, have a seat here. Yeah, yeah there we go. Switch it up.